Alec Baldwin was forced to change the caption of a photo of his wife. Hilaria Baldwin getting a back rub from their six-year-old son, Leo, after fans called it sexually suggestive. In his first Instagram post since prosecutors announced plans to charge him with involuntary manslaughter, the Boss Baby star wrote, The old let me give you a back rub ploy, which prompted followers to call out his word choice. That's a pretty F, King weird comment to make on a photo of your son and his mother, wrote one user. His caption is disgusting, commented another. Sexualizing children is always so weird but your own child. Yikes, added a third fan. Alec, 64, later added, potato chips to follow in light of the commentary and explained in the comments section, I adjusted the text. I guess because dot 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 you know, there is so much of that Reddit trash out there. The 30 Rock alum and his fake Spanish wife are the subject of endless theories on Reddit that she never carries their children when she is pregnant. In August 2022, Hilaria even had to defend herself against a psycho rumor that her baby bump was fake. My friends made a good point about my belly, the former yoga instructor, 39, captioned a mirror selfie. It kind of looks fake like I ate a ball. I guess the psycho conspiracy theorists online with way too much time on their hands have somewhat of a point here, she continued. While the baby bump conspiracies may have been an issue for the longtime couple, who have seven children together, they're nothing compared to the looming legal charges Alec is facing over the fatal shooting of Russ cinematographer Helena Hutchins in October 2021. Santa Fe District Attorney Mary Carmack always said in a statement last week that the film's armor, Hannah Gutierrez-Reed, will also be charged with involuntary manslaughter, which carries a maximum sentence of 18 months in jail. On my watch, no one is above the law, and everyone deserves justice, she said. An attorney for Alec called the charge against his client a terrible miscarriage of justice. Mr. Baldwin had no reason to believe there was a live bullet in the gun or anywhere on the movie set. He relied on the professionals with whom he worked who assured him the gun did not have live rounds, Luke Nikas told Page Six. We will fight these charges, and we will win.